here we have this nice tripod for a camera. And when I say nice, trust me, I mean very nice. One aspect about this, as you might notice, is how tall it is. And one way you can change that is from these little clips down here. If you open these clips, it allows you to slide this back and it allows you to get any angle you want. So if we do this, we can get a more of a upwards angle so we can get something high up and just click it. But we can also raise it again and it's easy it's just a click and lock if you come look right here i just pull this out and if you look just click and lock also on the bottom of the feet right here since we're talking about being tall and being stable it has these little adjuster things and these will adjust to any of the surface ground you have so if i put it here it immediately bends and these adjustable clips go all the way up so it can be this short this short this tall this tall or it could be all the way up here. Another way to make it taller is in the back. If you twist this lever, you can simply pick this up by using this little um, spinny thing. And it immediately raises the camera. Look at it. Immediately raises the camera. You turn it back to the level you need it. Tighten it. And now look how much taller it is. Being tall like this will be good for recording sports, taking pictures of animal wildlife, anything good like a family photo. You can just like get and have a bunch of people. Um, and to let it loose, you just go like this. And then you just slowly turn this lever down right here. And then the camera comes all the way back down. Like how cool is that, right? And then you tighten it again. And look, completely stable, not going anywhere. Another cool feature about this is that if you need to record something on the ground, all you have to do is go like, all you need to do to point it down is to come over here, turn this loose lever, and then it will immediately open this up, which allows you to point it down. So if you have wildlife here, if you have wildlife there, and you're trying to get a nice angle on it, you go like this and you just click, click your picture, it's done, you want to be finished. You just put this back, come right here, tighten this again, and now this will not flip back up on you. It won't like surprise you as you're walking. This lever right here and this handle is really nice because it allows you to do a full 360 rotation with the camera, which will be really good if you need to do a video. It also allows you to do angles like this. It allows you to do angles like this. Um, it allows you to do a bunch of spinning stuff and you can tighten and loosen it with this knob in the back right here. And another great thing about the stabilization is this hook. And what this hook does is it has many purposes. It can be for a weight so that it's nice and sturdy. It can be for a camera bag in case you have your camera bag like this one, which just comes in. You can just hang this right here and it's out of your way. The animals aren't going to smell it. Um, and you can use it for a lot of other things like hang your keys or anything else on it that you want out of your way. Um, another great thing is it has this level. And this shows you how stable it is. So like right now, it's not that stable. But if we line up the dot right in the center of the line, look at that. How stable is that? All in all, this is a very good product. I would definitely recommend buying this. Another great feature in the back right here is this free switch. So to do this, you just simply click and the camera is out. And look how easy that is. Put it back in. Open this. Put that right back in. Close it. Boom, camera's back in. It also comes with this user manual, which tells you everything you need to know. Um, definitely a great product. I would 100% recommend buying this tripod. Another great feature about this tripod is that it comes with a phone stand in the bag as well. And to adjust it, you just spin this knob and this comes off. And because most of these, it's a spring, so it just pulls and lets go and your phone will drop out randomly. Or it may like mess up while taking pictures. But this one is a specific knob. So you have to turn this to the left in order to get it loose. It comes with this little button right here. You turn it on, connect it to the Bluetooth. It has a iPhone and Android camera. You stand back like this whenever you're ready. You click the button and it takes a picture. This will be great for indoors or for family photos when you don't have your camera. This tripod has many uses. It can be used for games, like for filming games, for filming sports, for filming... Um, I don't know, animals, family photos, anything you can think of. I would definitely recommend buying this tripod for all of your camera and photography needs.